going to give because I know your brand. I know your aesthetic. Uh, I've studied. How long you been with me? I've been with you for about... Some days and stuff? Or no? A little after that. I wasn't, I wasn't an a outside stand. Like, I wasn't doing the camp outs and stuff at that time. I was just doing, uh, buying the music, knowing the words, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm, I was a barb since Be Me Up Scotty era. That's when I first heard you. I first heard you on that, that era, Be the Itty Bitty Picky. What is one of your favorite records that I don't perform on the tour that you want me to perform on the next tour? I always tell people you can't ask a favorite Nicki song because there's so many tears. There's tears to a Nicki catalog. There's features. There's gospel. There's Latin. This bitch, you know, she do so much. So when you're so diverse, uh, there's a... there's a lot but sweet dreams with little wayne it's about time you stop paying that dust there's a couple of things you got to stop paying dust okay let me tell you why a lot of times like when you go on tour now and you play it after playing something that sounds super quality and you play something like that in the middle of your show it can kind of like take away from it you know when the fans are enjoying a certain kind of quality of the music yeah but i feel like the real ball is supposed to know when you come out like past that crown to the real queen, you know your girl get it popping like a pill fiend. <laughs> well, um, okay, so I'll think about that because you know that's, that was always my one of my favorite. That sweet dream, even before I did it, I loved that song. You know, um, but but one of the things I noticed a lot of fans fuck with, and I never knew like to even or even thought about uh, before, um, performing it is high school. Like a lot of my fans fuck with that song. Um, like when Tay play that shit, he plays high school. Like every time we see each other, Tay be playing high school, and here I am. And yeah, you're not. You have you have the worst taste in your own catalog. I know. It's like you don't like none of the hits. You pay everything. <laughs> you pay that. You don't like the good stuff. I, I guess not. Um, I'm switching it up a little bit this time. What's your move for the album? What's your move? For <laughs> You know what? The move for the album. It's, it's um well, I mean, you 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 guys heard the, the, the new records on Being Me Up Scotty that I put, right? But yeah. then Love but friends. then there's there's some sounds that I used to play with before that I had stopped playing with. And I just did a song that I can't say much about it, but I was like, oh shit, you know, I heard it and I said, what made me ever stop doing these kinds of songs? You know what I'm saying? And so I think that my fans are gonna be happy with how how this album feels so full circle. Mm. That's how this album feels. Mm. Yeah. So we're getting nostalgia, like a Pink Friday 2 type of thing. Just another memory. <laughs> um, and that's not an actual that. <laughs> I know what you're getting at, but that wasn't wasn't that. But and shout out to um. Shout out to those women for sending me in. You to thrive in this industry. Like, with all the negativity that you get, with all the, the darts that get thrown at you, you, like, it's like, you're so resilient. How do you keep your resilience? And still, like, like you still have so much class and you're still a stand-up woman throughout mm -hmm. all of this. Like, how do you maintain that? How do you keep that up? Well, first of all, I appreciate you for saying that. And I'm, I'm just putting on my lip gloss because I keep on li licking my lips. Um... I was thinking about some some stuff like that, you know, today, um, too, because I jokingly put on Twitter, you know, oh, yeah, when that person had post, posted uh, Nikki after she done been canceled for the fourth time this week. You know what? I think that people are expecting me or treating me certain ways or doing certain things to me, and they're expecting me to have a response like the old me. Mm. And they don't know there's a different type of power within me now. Um, I would say it's from my son, but I would, I, but maybe seventy five percent is from my son, and then there's another, there's another twenty five percent from from just 
a collection of other things that have that have given me this like I don't know like this Teflon thing. Um, things just don't phase me like they used to because I know that my talent can't and hasn't been duplicated, matched. Duplicated, matched. Um, and because of that, I don't feel bad about any. What they can't say is that I'm not say is that I'm not talented as a rapper, as an artist, as a writer, as an MC. That's when it, that's when somebody should be mad. Like if you play ball and you all of a sudden wake up one day and you can't, you know, sh shoot from the three point line or whatever it is, then you might you might start feeling sad and down yourself. With me, I'm in such a good space um, in terms of remember I told y'all I had had writer's block for a minute. Yeah, yeah. And, then, and once I got over that, like I was just back to enjoying everything like now i'm enjoying things again yeah it looks like it and it, it, it feeds off to us and i love that i love that for you the place that you're at right now i can't hear you I can't hear you. Nobody can hear you. None of us. Okay, now. Can hear me now? What was it given? Was <laughs> Sorry. Somebody was calling me. That's why. Um. <laughs> no, let me tell you something. I realize that people keep comparing people to me or or moments to mo my moments and stuff like that and people are forgetting that um i haven't put out an album but i also haven't put out a single in a couple of years uh, tell us about it we know. yet 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 i'm still no, doing we these. haven't even you haven't even kicked off the era fully you have not given no single with the that that went that got radio treatment no promo tours no press runs we but how try. am I? But how am I always still most listened to, most streamed female rapper? If not the, if it. not, if not the top, then always in the top. How? How? You know. And once I see stuff like that, I'm like, oh man. It, you know, trust. <laughs> once this new shit, <laughs> no god. So that's where I think my my piece and my and my vibe like that you guys see is almost like she's like, you know unfazed don't give a fuck because i know what kind of arsenal i have i know how how happy my fans my real fans are gonna be when they hear what i have and that's what gives me that so i don't give a fuck motherfuckers know they can't cancel me because if they could they would have been it that's for Man. that's for so what bothers people the most about me is that unlike most people i don't have that fear that most of the artists have, or most
You see the damn car? Yo, what's up, gang?
I'm keeping it on me. She said she don't love nobody. I told her I was heartless. She said she just love. I could be gone by the morning. Ladies and gentlemen.